There is a real problem with space travel, and it might have something to do with not being able to go fast enough. Colonizing planets in other galaxies and finding alien Earths can never be truly realistic until humans find a way to travel faster than the speed of light. But why has the speed limit always been so difficult to surpass? The speed of light in a vacuum is about 186,000 miles per second. And most scientists think that this is a barrier we cannot break through. Einstein tried to explain this with his theory of special relativity and set forth two fundamental issues with light speed travel. One, the relativity of time, and two, the increasing amount of energy needed to push objects through space. In his theory of special relativity, Einstein posits that time does not flow at a steady rate. Rather, time is relative, meaning it can speed up or slow down depending on how fast you are moving through space compared to something else. This is also known as time dilation. And theoretically, if travel at the speed of light is possible, time would stop entirely. Let's say an astronaut manages to travel at close to light speed to the nearest star. The time elapsed for the astronaut would be much less than the time elapsed for those left behind on Earth. So upon returning, the astronaut would actually have aged much less than people on Earth. Second, as an object moves through space, it needs an increasing amount of energy to propel it. This is because when something speeds up, its mass increases compared to its mass at rest. This increase in mass means that every extra unit of energy used in speeding up the object becomes less effective. Working from this measure, if a spaceship was to travel at the speed of light, it would require an infinite amount of energy, and that poses very real limits to space travel. However, despite these physical limits, scientists are constantly looking for ways to break this speed barrier and make the impossible possible. Until then, there's always a Millennium Falcon. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.